Tragic scene this morning in a Hialeah neighborhood when firefighters are called to a house in flames. Two women found dead inside that home. CBS 4's Gary Nelson is there live for us with the latest. Gary. Well, uh, it's believed that uh, there are two factors that predominantly contributed to the two deaths in this uh, pinkish colored home in Hialeah early this morning. One, a lack of working smoke detectors and two, steel bars on the windows. Hialeah firefighters rushed to a home on West 79th Place about 4 o'clock this morning. They were delayed in getting inside the house by an iron gate covering the front door. As a uh, forced entry through a gated front door, they found uh, heavy smoke conditions inside. The smoke was banking down to approximately their knees. The blaze began in the living area of the home. Firefighters found an 80-something-year-old woman and her daughter in her 60s in a bedroom, a bedroom with a window covered by metal bars, bars apparently with no interior release mechanism. Both of these ladies were found near the window on top of each other, uh, and it is a gated window. Obviously, their efforts to remove themselves from the building were uh, unsuccessful. And firefighters believe the home had no working smoke detectors that could have alerted the victims soon enough to get out of the house through a door before the fire blocked their way. A long time friend and neighbor has identified the victims here as Amelia Rodriguez in her upper 80s and her daughter Alba Rodriguez in her 60s. The daughter, the uh, family friend tells us, would not have been here last night, but her mom's normal, usual caregiver was on a trip out of town. The investigation into the cause of the fire continues. We're live in Hialeah, Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.